What's going on YouTube? This is Adam Guy here from A Guy Studios, and today I'm going to be doing a fix for you. Well, it's more of like a tutorial, but it's helping you fix. Basically, what it's for, it's for Far Cry 4. Um, now, a lot of people, as well as myself, um, have been having this problem. Uh, I can see. Um, that's just from sort of looking through the internet. Pretty much, the starting of the game. When you load it, it the not it it crashes basically the black screen it just doesn't go any further um and it just comes up with not responding so basically what i'm going to do now is show you what that is what people seem to be having problem with i believe this is from steam and you play i would imagine so it loads up like this as you can see and that's it I've got my uh, running in a window mode so I can obviously record it um, but that's it as you can see not responding nothing absolutely nothing so you have to close it down blah blah, blah quit out of it that's not good you know you, you wanted to play the game so the way around this and the way to fix this is it's pretty easy basically what it is is you need to come over to your computer here or my computer um, I've obviously got desktop shortcut. If you haven't, you just go start menu, computer, same principle. And basically what you do is you right click on that and go to manage. That will then load this sort of menu up. If you can't get to it through there, which I'd imagine you will be able to, you can go to right click again, go properties, and then that will load up pretty much your system like this and go device manager which is a quicker way of doing it other than going the other way but either way you do that and pretty much what you want to do once you get to your device manager is you want to come over to human interface devices which is here and actually just to show you the other way so you don't get confused you go manage now load this one up and you just click device manager there so that's if you're going off the shortcut and the other ones if you're going through your properties and basically once you've opened this you want to come down to this one here which is your game controller right click on it and hit disable yes um don't ask me how it works or why it works it just works i don't know why um pretty much if you've got like a controller or anything plugged in or if you had had one plugged in just disable that pretty much and that will it should allow the game to run as i'm about to demonstrate now so once again back on to where I loaded the game from and as you can see last time I loaded it it um it just crashed straight away it just crashed and basically once I'd gone in done the control or dis disabled the uh, games controller like magic I run the game again and once it loads voila the game loads it works and it runs fine why this is I don't know uh, maybe there will be a patch or a fix or something coming out to to fix it um but as far as i'm aware that is the only way around to fix it at the moment um, I hope you find this um, please comment like and subscribe uh, like i said it was going to be a quick video i didn't really want to talk too much about it so it's pretty easy um so like i said i hope you enjoyed the video please comment like and subscribe uh, share the video if you know anyone else it's the same thing. And very much guys and goodbye